channel. My name is Christy. For those of you that are new here, I do make planner videos. For those of you who are returning, welcome back. I'm so glad you decided to come back again this week. Um, this week was Halloween. Uh, we had our work. We don't do a contest. We didn't even do like group costumes this year. We could have entered a regional contest with that, but we did individual costumes. And if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen the uh, my, my unicorn headband and hair, which was um, quite interesting. And I have a newfound love of purple and blue hair. So, <laughs> um, yeah, so this past week was pretty fun. Um, I have a short work week this week. It's only four days. So, um, we're going to get to planning and yes, my nails have not been done. I'll be honest with you. I have been lazy today, just not feeling it, but that's okay. So let's take a look at last week. Um, I, obviously, as I kind of talked about last weekend, these weeks are always a little bit crazy because it was end of month. So there's always a lot to do and get done before we get there on top of it. Something that um, I, I went from knowing that Shane and Jeffrey's palette was launching this day. And I thought I was going to need to buy Louis Tomlinson tickets. But as it turns out, I got into the artist presale here. So I got those there. And then it's a good thing because I would my nerves would have been shot if I had had to buy tickets on top of that yesterday. That was a whole thing. Anyway. So, yeah, um, this is where we ended last week. Still have tomorrow, obviously, to go, but uh, I'm like, really excited, too, about this right here. Hate losing daylight during the day, but love getting an extra hour of sleep back. Anything to get me more sleep at this point. So, um, this week we will be planning for the week of November the 4th through the 10th. Um, I'm trying to get this back where we had it last week because this is a whole lot. Okay. Okay. So, um, the kit that I will be using this week, cause now we're jumping into the kits that I really wanted to use like a month ago, but I couldn't use because the weather wasn't cooperating here. Cause yeah. So this week we will be using the autumn kit from Nicole Alexia Designs. Um, as you can tell, it has gold foiling. That's really catching the light nicely, I think. Um, I love the art on this kit. It's just so pretty. It's very subtle. And I think the matte makes it even more subtle. So um, this is the full boxes. And then we have obviously the date numbers, some functional items, as well as the three bow checklists. Um, and then we also have um, our quarter boxes, half boxes, and um, just boxes. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really tired today. So if I lose my train of thought, that's what it is. I'm just, oof. I don't know what it is today. Um... Then we have our little things, our cut washi and our glitter headers. These glitter headers are so gorgeous. I can't. I think I'm going to stick with these three in the spread just because I really like that progression. I don't know what it is. I just really, really like it. And then we have our bow checklist as well as some flags and some habit trackers. And our bottom washi as well as our date covers. Oh, look at that catching the light. So pretty. So, so, so pretty. Okay, so we're going to get started. I'm going to tell you something that I'm going to try to do differently this week because I don't have a washi tape that's going to match this kit. So what I'm going to try doing is stacking the glitter header on top of here because then I'm still going to have more than enough room for um, the cover there. And I'm hoping that maybe that'll cover it all. We're going to see. So um, as as is the case every time, what I'm going to do is lay all of that information down, lay, lay all the base down, <clears throat> and we'll come back here to start putting the spread together. And yeah, um, I will be back in just a second.
also, if you happen to be considering a, a, one of the Recollections planners from Michaels or you have one, just as an FYI, as you saw, glitter header on top of the box where it's marked for and then your date cover and it covers the whole thing. So, I'm probably, I probably got them in there uneven, but that's okay. It is what it is. I just wanted to try it and see if it worked, and it did. So I feel like I have a lot more box room here to work with. That may be a good thing, maybe a bad thing, but we're going to see. So let's talk a little bit about what I've pulled in for this week. Um, I only pulled out one sheet of my sticky notes from Chic Street Sticker Boutique. I have a whole bunch of samplers from, um, from Nikki's shop, um, some of mine as well, which, by the way, uh, weekly plug, uh, I am a PR team member for Nicole Alexia Designs. Um, when you order, you can use code Christy15 at checkout for 15% off your purchase. Um, and then in the comments box to the side there, if you'll just put my name, you'll get my foil freebie as well. And uh, yeah, so let's put that to the side. Um, and if you're, the end slate as well has my, my, if you want a closer look at it, has my foil freebie on it. <coughs> okay. So I also went ahead and pulled out a couple of things I purchased. <coughs> Sorry guys. From Sweet Bean Plants because, um, we are in Christmas season for me. Um, Christmas decorating season, Christmas gift wrapping season. Yes, I know it is only the beginning of November. Don't judge me. It's just what I do. So we're going to put that to the side. I pulled out this um, sampler sheet from uh, Mandy Lynn Plans just because I really like this script and I wanted to make sure I had it. I do have a doctor's appointment script out because I have to take my mom to the doctor on Monday. And then these I think were something that I just purchased and they just ended up in here. So that's something. <laughs> I think I'm going to pull out the silver um, version of my freebie to show you guys because I think it's probably the one that's going to show up best in the light. I also have a media sheet from Nicole Alexia Designs, um, a payday, uh, a money sheet from Nicole Alexia Designs. I have my grocery run from Cute Sticky Designs, um, the planning time one from Cute Sticky Designs. Uh, this is a planner one from Nicole Alexia Designs, $2 Tuesday sheet. Um, Target run and work from all from Nikki's shop. So those were um, a two dollar Tuesday, I believe. So I'm gonna put all of this to the side. Let me see if I can find. Since I have to put these to the side anyway, because I'm brilliant. Um, I think I put those on top. Let me see which one's gonna show up best in the light in here. Not that one. What did I do with that huge stack of rose gold ones that I had a second ago? Literally just had them. Brilliant. Did I put them in the binder? I wouldn't have thought so. Of course, odder things have happened with me. I can't lay hands on them right now, guys. Okay, that's that's my day. Uh, so yeah, I the sticker sheet down here on the floor. Okay. So here is, this is mine, my freebie. So if you guys wanted a different, um, a closer look, it's got um, the coffee cup, grocery bag, uh, laundry, piggy bank, the planner, the camera, the um, play button, the, oh, he's pulling in the trash can, the grocery cart, the plan with Christy, thanks to Chris for that one, hair appointment, doctor appointment, laundry, groceries, coffee please, and day off. 
get to use one of these lovely little day off stickers this week. Okay, moving on. Okay, so what do I want to do first this week? Um, let's look at our boxes because I need to figure out this layout first. I really think I want this one with the big leaf on it on Thursday, even though it would probably fit better on Monday, but I just did that for the big box, so we're not going to do that. So should we do like we did before where we start? Let's do like maybe one, one, two, one. Maybe we'll do that. So let's go ahead and just for giggles, we're just going to throw this down on Monday. I mean Monday, on Thursday. That's where I was going with that. Oh boy, here we go with this again. Me and premium matte paper are mortal enemies. Not really, but we do not get along well when it comes to laying down on paper. Okay, that's good. So we need one on Monday then and on Sunday. So, what do I have left now? I've got three days on either side. I've got two that have the green tones. Okay, so I think what we're going to do is... I think we're going to do green neutral burgundy gray neutral burgundy so let's go ahead and lay our so maybe we'll put the little flowers on Monday yeah let's do that let's put the flowers on Monday it's the beginning of the week we all need well it's really greenery but we all need some stems in our life And by the way, guys, I know that I told you that I ordered the Tati Beauty palette. For those of you who are makeup people, um, if pre-orders are still open for that palette, I highly encourage you to go purchase it. That palette, I, and yes, I am a Tati fan, but the one thing I'm going to say is that that palette like the glitters are insane insane i need to tighten you guys in a little bit probably um i wore it literally took me less than 10 minutes to do my eyeshadow yesterday and that was like really building a color in the crease putting a metallic on my lid and then laying glitter on top of it they are insane today i threw one of the sequin tones on my best friend's lid that's all it took it was just like throw it on there blend the edges and you're done so, if you like eyeshadow, but you don't like having to spend forever dealing with eyeshadow, highly recommend Tati Beauty. Highly, highly, highly. So then here, we're going to come over here. What do we want to use here? This is going to be one of these, and I think we'll do... Yeah, this is what we're going to do. Over on this side, i use the flower. We're going to keep the beginning of the week. It looks like pretty floral, but that's okay with me because I really would prefer... So I think we'll have to start the, we'll start that so that that ends up being, and I, if you want to know how serious I am now that I've found Tati Beauty and I'm going to have two Jeffree Star palettes, well three, if you count the mini controversy, um, purged out my entire eyeshadow collection <laughs> I don't know that that was the smartest thing for me to do but I did I, I get it I did keep a lot of stuff I just I didn't keep 
most of the stuff that I was holding on to. All of my Too Faced palettes are gone. Um, all of my, no, I kept one Tarte palette. I kept the Tarte and Aspen Ovard palette, I think. Let me see if I turn this light up. This is looking a little dull. Oh, there we go. You can tell the sun's starting to uh, go down a little bit earlier because it's starting to get a little bit. Okay. So let's put that there. Okay. So we have two. So now at the top, we're going to start over here. I know I want this on Saturday. So let's go ahead and put the cozy blankets on Saturday. Because then I have cozy blankets on Saturday and cozy socks on Sunday. Which I just feel like is perfect. I don't know how I'm going to feel about that extra little scanch of room there. But I think on... Saturday and Sunday, it might be kind of nice because I was going to struggle to fit everything in there. So now let's go back to Wednesday and we're going to lay this one down. Yeah, so I decided that like since I was buying all these palettes that I just I really needed to get rid of a lot of the stuff I had. Um, so I went through Thursday night knowing that I would be purchasing the Jeffrey and Shane collection on Friday. And I just ditched everything and I brought it to work so that some of the ladies I work with who don't really have a lot of makeup could um, kind of build up their collections as well. So really, like, I think that that was probably the best thing for me to do it. <laughs> um, okay, so what are we going to do? So I can't have the checklist down here, so checklist has to go there. So let's go ahead and lay down that checklist. And just because I don't know what that's going to look like right there, um, and I don't want to, like, get it too much. Am I too zoomed out now? Ugh. I am on the struggle bus today. Let's just do this, too, because I think that's just smarter. Okay, so this is Tuesday, so we're going to use this lovely peachy caramel color. Is that an appropriate color description of it? Probably not, but that's what I like to consider it. Oh, I hadn't considered that. <laughs> well, you know, maybe what we'll do is we might just leave that little scant piece of white space down there. Or, better yet, so let's go I think I'm going to go ahead with that same color in the middle for the washi anyway. So let's just go ahead and I think I know what we're going to do because these are the only days that's going to have this struggle. So what we'll do is let's go ahead. This is going to be a very monochrome day I have a feeling. With a couple of exceptions, but I think for the most part, it's going to be pretty monochrome. Come on. There you go. Okay, so the great news is what we can do. I'll have to build from there. So the checklist is there. That's going to be there, so the checklist has to be here. Or I could start there. That might be what we do there. I think the only days we're going to have to worry about what I'm about to do is probably going to be on those. Because I think on the rest of them, I will just kind of scooch it up. Just like that. That way we're not operating like this on everything. Okay, so let's find a piece of washi now that is about that size. I think that one's going to be a bit too big. This one might be right on target. 
Let's see. I mean, I think it's going to be close enough. It'll fill the space. Without looking overly awkward, right? Yeah, I think so. That was my, my first boo-boo. So let's just mark that down. Okay, so that means the checklist is going to have to go here. So let's come back to Monday real quick. I don't even know if I feel like I need a checklist on Monday. We may not. We're going to hold off on that and then we're going to come back because I feel like it's going to be more boxes and things like that because I'm going to be home. So we're going to see. Okay, I'll wait. So if this is here, this has to be the others. So that means this box has to come from the bottom. See, it's a good thing I thought about that because y'all know me, I would have just slapped it down and called it a day. Wow, okay. Oop, that's, that's not there. What about if we go right there? That's a little over, but we're going to roll with it. Okay. So we're going to have to butt something up against this one. This isn't playing out the way I wanted it to. Okay. But we're going to make it work. And the reason why we're going to make it work is I like not having to use white out at the top of the spread. I feel like I'm still going to need some sort of checklist over there. So let's do this. Maybe on Monday, what we're going to do instead is we're just going to use this little, this little baby checklist. Let's not put it in right now, though, because I need to lay other things down first. Genius. Okay. I'm getting ahead of myself, if that's what's happening here. Okay, so let's kind of finish up laying down glitter headers. I am a disaster today. That's okay, though. We're going to get through this. Okay, so let's put this little glitter header down. <clears throat> and guys, let's just uh, say that this this whole spread is going to be an example of why you don't plan when you just woke up from a nap. Yep. That's all that's going to be. That's okay, though. I think that the prettiness of the kit can even out how stupid I am sometimes when it comes to this stuff. I don't want to say stupid, but you know what I mean. Like, it wasn't properly thought out. Let's just say it that way. It wasn't properly thought out. There. So here I need a coppery one. Okay, so that at least that divides that up a little bit. I don't even know if I really needed to do that, but we did it anyway. Three, those three. Okay, let's flip over here now. I need to, for the first day at least, keep this open. Let's see. I just got a text. Hold, please. lay this out for a second. So I need my checklist here on this day. 
So it's going to be the lovely red tone. And let's go ahead and get our glitter header as well for the bottom. And let's just build from the bottom on this one. Who needs YouTube royalty free music when you can just listen to my puppy click through the halls of my house? The answer is nobody. Nobody needs it. Yep, that's good. Okay. Actually, you know what I probably should have done? And I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pull this header back up over here. And I'm just going to put that little two checklist, whatever the hell I laid it, there it is, at the bottom here. Just like that. And then we're gonna put this here. And then we can just cover everything else up. We're just going to have a very scant checklist that day. Okay, yeah, I think that's fine. That's a good bit of room to write down stuff that I need. Okay, let's get back to what we were doing because I feel like I'm getting sidetracked and it's just... Okay, so here we're going to put this one down. And I feel like it's throwing me off because I can see... Oh, that went down nicely. Um, I can see those purple strips and I feel like that's throwing me off and I think there's not a glitter header there. That's okay. When you get used to a new style of doing things, you have to. I'm sorry that looks crooked. It's just the way the stickers went down. And I'm not about to pull this whole spread up and fix it all. If I'm being honest. So checklist is going to have to go up here. So this is going to be another one where we need to pull one of these. And this is a little bit darker, but it's going to be okay. Okay, so checklist at the top. For this burgundy day, I could have just cut down this big checklist probably a little bit, um, and I'm not mad about it. I really don't need a whole lot that day. I will probably try to even do my meal prep and all that tomorrow, um, even though I'm not working Monday, just because it makes my life easier on Monday. We'll see though. I say that kind of stuff all the time, and then and I don't. So let's try to pull this one again. I just feel like that would be a smidgen too fat, and it is. All these notifications about freezing fog and frost and ugh. It's been a lot the last couple of days. I like, we, like Thursday when I went into work, I was like, okay, it's a little chilly, no big deal. Blow it off. By the time I walked out, I was like, oh no, honey. Mm -mm. But... The funny thing is, I can't really complain about it because all I've been begging for for weeks now is cool weather. So, <laughs> I'm just going to shut up and I'm going to enjoy it, even though I'm freezing. But, all that to say, this is the time of year I sleep the best because I'm the type of person who needs, like, really, really, I need to be cold, cold to sleep. Um, so, yeah, it's it's a good thing for me. In that sense I guess so so checklist has to go at the bottom here where's my checklist sheet okay and this is this color Okay, 
Okay, so we got that down. So let's go ahead then and put our headers. Actually, I can probably, let's just take both of these and put them on my hands. I went to Michael's today, and first of all, let's just start with, I found a couple of really cute pieces of decor for fall for next year for so cheap. I was so excited. Um, I think they were all 80% off, so I think I got like two signs. One of them was originally $15, and I paid um, three for it. And it was one of the um, glass pumpkin spice saying ones. And I really, really loved it. I thought it was really cute. Um, so my checklist is going to go here. Uh, and then also I finally found the uh, Chrissy and Design stuff in there. And I adore it all. It is so cute. Um, I wanted to get all the stickers, but... Tell you right now it's just not a thing that's gonna happen um also though they do have for those of you that love the idea of bullet journaling like me but you aren't creative enough to draw out the spreads like me um, they have now in the i guess it's the recollections line i'm, I'm assuming it is they have guided journals that have the base part of the spreads drawn out for you I, it's so cute and I like Loki. I was like, no, you just bought <laughs> a print press and weeks. Sit yourself down. Um, but they're like really, really cute. I like them a whole lot. Um, so if you're in the market for something like that, definitely go check those out because they're really, really cute. Um, they were by, um, I don't know if everybody's Michael set up the same, but I know that ours has like a big wall of like planner stuff in the like aisle usually where you walk in. Um, but just look for the planner stuff and where they have all of their, um, the happy planners and the recollections planners laid out on a wall together. And they're in that. Um, they had some hard bound that had some soft bound and the hard bounds had like the, um, the elasticized strap around them too. So let's take a look at this and see where we've ended up so far. I think we did pretty good. I think we've done all right. I'm, I'm feeling this. I like it a lot actually. Like a whole lot. Um, I think I'll feel better once I get things down over those purple pieces so that they're just like gone. Um, but this has actually worked out better than I thought it would after our, like the initial like, oh crap, what am I going to do to block that? So I think um, that the purple, I think it's going to turn out really good. Okay, um, let me gather myself and we are going to jump into the week. Okay, so we're going to start. Let's go ahead and go over to Monday. So this is going to be our burgundy. Let's do the first one. We're going to do, I think, this. Do I want to do the bigger or the smaller? Bigger, smaller, bigger, smaller. Where's my... I think we'll do it with the skinny one, maybe at the top. Probably gonna blend, oh, I need to tighten you guys in, sorry about that. Okay. Well, hello there. Okay, so let's just go ahead and bump this up at the top here. It's kind of gonna blend a little bit, but I don't need it to like stand out a whole lot. Come on. You know, me and clear paper get along worse than me and uh, premium map. So we're going to put this little day off right in the center, just like that. Even if it's a little off kilter, it's fine. I probably could have done that better, but I can see it. It's good for me. Okay. So. 
So that takes care of that now. Why do I want to actually we'll use this at the bottom of the day? Ooh. We're gonna use this marquee sticker. And that's gonna be the mark that it is. I think we'll use you know what? I can't drink wine, but we're still gonna no we're not. We're just gonna use the balloons. Use the balloons. And this is here to mark that it is three weeks till my birthday. Then, what else? Do you need to put a small work box in or something? I think I'll do actually we'll probably put it right over this little purple thing right there. And I'll put a little computer on it. I'm gonna come over to this side with it. So now the only thing that I have left to mark Really and truthfully, actually, now I have two things to mark. I'm not using that giant box. I'm going to use all of these boxes here. Actually, no, I'm not. Okay, I just realized what I'm going to do. When was the last time I pulled a little thing off of paper? Because Monday is, right? No, it's not. Why did everybody tell... Whatever, man. Whatever, we're just going to have a gap in space here. Nope, I'm just going to have to use the big one. It's fine. Let's just pull that up. I don't know why. My mother... Now, I want everybody to stop and think about this a second. My mother, an army veteran, told me that Veterans Day was Monday. Yep. Actually, do I want to drop this down? I think we'll put it right here. And then let's pull the doctor appointment sheet. Probably could have used a Target run as well because if there's anything we need from Target, we can go right there because it's right next to the doctor. And we'll go ahead and just put that down. Okay, Tuesday. I'm going to put down one of these little labels because. As always, there is a meeting of some sort. Do I know what kind? Nope. Usually don't. Okay, and then we are going to work insurance aging all day. So I think we'll use this little flag dealy. And I think we may actually put it upside down, backwards, whatever you want to say. And hope that I don't really screw this up. I probably just really screwed that up. That looks close enough to even, I think. It doesn't look too bad. Okay, and then for the afternoon, my fingers are just not working to get stickers off of paper today, kids. There it goes. Okay. 
Okay, so that's going to be, so we need. What do I want to use for sampler stuff? <laughs> for the posting, I do believe we're going to use Mr. Piggy Bank here. Okay, so let's just take a look at our, what we have so far. So this is going to be meeting and insurance aging. So let's come over here. Put the little piggy bank right there. Oh, him's cute. Okay. Where's Chris's sampler at? His new one. Oh, I just had it. Yep, this is me in a nutshell, just throwing stuff around. Is that his new one? That's mine. Oh, there's Chris's. What's on his? What do I want to use for the insurance agent? I may just use a little asterisk. Oh, I mean, honestly, here. Um, actually, I think that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to keep this day very monochrome. I'm going to use the alarm clock for the meeting. And then I'll use the asterisk for the insurance aging. Just like that. Okay, Wednesday. Not a whole lot going on here. Um, basically just two boxes. So what do I want to do for that? What color is that? It's the green. It's green. Green. Ooh, we have one of these sparkly pretty ones. And I think we'll put it right at the top to mark the insurance aging. Just like that and then the only other thing that we'll do is that I want to have the business assistant that I've been training do the afternoon insurance claims with me so that he can see how to do them so for that What do I want to use there, guys? I need to make sure I mark my planner picture days, too. But we'll do that in a second. Do we just want to use this little computer? Nope. Let me get a two. Maybe we'll just use... I don't think we're going to mark that with anything specific, honestly. We're just going to leave that be, and if I have the need to put something there, we will, but otherwise, I'm not going to stress about it. And actually, while I'm thinking about it, let's just go ahead and pull these out. And let's put... Oh, well, I don't have room on Monday. Yay! But we can put one on Wednesday. got that down at the bottom now the planner picks some of these days are darker so you won't see them until I like flip it there you go now you can see it okay Thursday um Thursday is another pretty basic day but I think we're gonna use this again because I want to and
Okay, so that's that. Then the only other thing, as of right now, that I know of, is going to be this is, no, Friday has three, but I also have stuff for me. Actually, I'm gonna set a new personal goal here. What the fruit, man? I can't pull up anything today. I think I'm gonna put this note, this here as a note. And then we're going to maybe use this. I don't know how many icons I'm going to actually use for some of this stuff. Okay. So... That's insurance agent complete. That's, I'm gonna have Drury do the posting and then actually let's just reverse that. Yeah, I think not. I'm just gonna leave that for now cause I'll just decide when I, when I get there. Okay, so Friday. I need, oops, just thought of something else I forgot. What else do I have there? You know what? We're pulling this out. Actually, no, we can layer stuff. It's fine. That's what I needed to mark on Tuesday, but I didn't because what I have here is a whole bunch of stuff that's just. Oof. So we're going to mark this again right here. When you forget to put $2 Tuesday down because you're so concerned. And if you guys haven't seen the colorways that Nikki has been doing the last couple of weeks, um, I'd highly suggest checking them out. They are beautiful. So now I've got $2 Tuesday in there. Um, Friday is obviously new releases. What do I want to do though for this? Um, cable bill is due this week. Yes, yes. Where's my financial stickers? Like right there. Boy, look at that no spend. That's what I should be using. Uh -huh. Okay, so we're going to use payday. And this week is my payday. Not that that means a whole lot to anybody. Um, so we're going to put that here. Actually, I think we're going to do... So let's put payday down. Ooh, thank God that fell face down. If that had fallen face first on, like back first on that desk, we've never gotten that up. So we're gonna put that little payday down there. Then I think what we'll do is pull the box that we were going to use before. What did I have? Oh, Friday I wanted to do. So I'm just going to put this here. And we're going to put pay the bills down, I think. You guys, I'm starving. We had lunch at Red Robin today, and while it was delightful, you know, unfortunately sweet potato fries just don't hold the same shine as like, something else, and I shouldn't have even had those, but I did, so. Okay, so let's just do, I had to look and see where my time was on this. Okay, we're going to put this down, because I'm going to try to teach have some afternoon claims there. So we'll just mark that down. Saturday. I don't think I have anything on deck next weekend, you guys. So it's just going to be my usual. So what we're going to mark next Saturday is. I'm going to pull this little box up. 
we're going to go ahead and pull this one too. And we'll use the whole sheet there. Okay. So we're going to pull this in here. And actually, I think we're just going to kind of butt it down right on that box so that it has a tiny bit of separation. Okay. And then we're going to put this down. The gators are playing right now, and I just have an odd feeling that I don't even want to look, so I'm not. That's just what it is. I love the Gators. I'm a Gators fan, but Florida, Georgia is so freaking stressful that I just can't do it this year. Oh, well, crap. Okay, I wonder if I can get this up. I can. So let's put that there. At least that came up fairly easy. If y'all see me scratching at it, I'm like, did you leave the sticky on the bottom? Because there's nothing there. Okay, so we're going to leave that there. Okay, so the reason I'm going to do it that way is I think we're going to um, actually, no, let's put that on Sunday. Let's just lay boxes down, and then I'm just going to have to I'm gonna figure it out as we go with that. So let's put this at the top on Sunday. What, what am I doing? Oh, goodness. Well, even better. I don't know why I thought that that red was what I was supposed to be using. I'm all over the place again, guys. Okay, you can see what I'm doing. Okay, so there's that. And then we'll use this big box. And the thing what I'm gonna start doing is this really cute one on my um, sampler that says hashtag plan with Christy. I think we're gonna use that for Sunday uploads. So let's just go ahead and get that down for the very first time ever in a spread. Look at that. Beautiful. We love it. Okay. So this is going to be for groceries. And I don't think we're going to overkill it. I think we're going to put this kind of... Kind of like the way that looks okay so now let's pull the grocery cart off of the sheet that way it has a little bit of color uh oh put that right there we love okay so then the other thing that we have this day is our not very good friend laundry. Just so gonna pull this up. I'm just gonna bump this down a little bit more. And the reason I put it in this order, like it probably would have looked better if I would put the small in between them. But honestly, this is just the order I do it. So Just lay that right there. And then we're going to pull the laundry basket off the sheet. And we're going to put it right there. Beautiful. I love it. Okay. So do we want to use the Hello Weekend here? Where do I want to use it if I use it? Would it fit up at the top? It might. It's kind of sitting on top that there oh well, it doesn't matter that's kind of cute up there right it works okay so let me clean up here a little bit I'm gonna keep 
some of this stuff right here by me for a second just because in case I decide I want to change something because it's me. Um, yeah, so let's zoom out. All the way. There we go. All right. So I'm going to fill it out the way I always do. And then we will come back here to finish up the video. This is where we ended up. I'm not very happy with my handwriting this week, but that's okay. We're gonna have those weeks. Look at this. Look at this foil. Oh gosh, this is so pretty. Like just watching it shift. So pretty. Okay, so let's just kind of go through what I have down. Um, so obviously I have my typical, the water and eating healthy over here. I have my this week, which is typically a, um, Big focus for the day is what I've been using it for. Day off on Monday, mom at the doctor um, that I need the BA I'm training to update treatment plans in the office and then three weeks till my birthday. Tuesday we have a meeting. We have $2 Tuesday and we have that I am posting with Dre that day as well. That's um, one of our things. I've got, <coughs> excuse me, um, planner pictures on Wednesday that I need to post. And then afternoon I'm working on claims with the BA I'm training and then insurance aging as well. Thursday is insurance aging with a reminder that I need to finish it by the next day, as well as that, uh, the BA I'm training will be posting Friday. We have payday and bills that are due. And then, um, that the BA I'm training will be working on the morning claims with me. Saturday, we have the planning time in there as well as edit and um, errands, but I just put the target run in there. I don't know why I didn't just leave the target run in there and not put the errands, but whatever, it's over now. <laughs> and now then Sunday, we have plan with Christy um, for my upload. We have groceries and we have laundry. So that is where I have left my spread for the week. As you guys can tell, I have continually had to turn the light up um, on my desk here because uh, the sun's just floating behind the cloud. Um, it's just, it's, it's setting. So yeah, um, that is where I am leaving this week. Um, I will have this kit link down below if it's still in the shop. I'm pretty sure it is. Um, but also go check out Nikki's new releases this week. She did another functional colorway. It's more of the Christmas colors. And with all of the kits coming up, it is perfect to have. Uh, let me know what you're most excited about now that we're into November. It's, for all of us Americans, it's almost Thanksgiving. Um, anybody Canadian that's watching obviously had it last month. But yeah, I'm super, super excited. Um, we're into November. This is my favorite time of year. Matter of fact, I'm about to go downstairs now and attempt to find something to eat because I'm starving. And then I'm hauling out the Christmas decorations. It's on. Um, so yeah, what are you most excited about now that it's this time of year? Um, 
yeah, just, just let me know down in the comments. And if you have any other questions for me, please leave them in the comments below as well. I would love to be able to do a video at some point where you guys just, um, Mark and just kind of talk about things that maybe you guys have questions about. So, um, please go ahead and I don't ask you guys to do this ever, but I'm going to ask you, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys next week in my next Play With Me. Bye guys. Awkward hands. Bye. It still didn't shut off. It doesn't like me. So, bye. Thank you.